Hey, what's going on, Fight Fans? This is Catholic Combat. I'm Rob Jarrell, and I'm in the middle of a workout right now, and I almost forgot to put this video up um, for the Kovalev Chalimba fight. I've been meaning to talk about it for a while, but I've just been having a hard time uh, really sitting down and concentrating. There's been a lot going on. So, um, so let's get down to the nitty gritty. I'm picking Kovalev. Uh, Hakeem is picking Kovalev too. I think Shalim is a really good fighter. But he does really nothing impressive. He can make the fight ugly. He can be a little bit slick. slick. But I don't think he has the firepower to take out Kovalev. I mean, Kovalev is one of the more destructive forces in the light heavyweight division as well as boxing. Look at his footwork. Look at his uh, punching. He throws very straight punches. And when I mean by straight, he throws them from the shoulder. He turns his body. He does not telegraph them. Look at his footwork. He has gotten away from resetting and just moving his feet to come right, just out of position. And then when he goes out, he has a nasty attitude. Shalimba, I don't think, has that sort of attitude, but he is a tough customer. The losses that he's had has been, you know, they haven't been too destructive. They haven't been, what can I say? Uh, his wins haven't been too impressive, but his losses haven't dropped him down at all. I think he's one of the better fighters at the light heavyweight division. I'd say he's top 10, maybe 11 to 12 at the lowest. Um, and we know we have Thomas Williams. Um, he lost to uh, Elida Alvarez, which I thought was a, uh, a good, which was a good win for Alvarez, but it doesn't really help him because he doesn't fight that often. And his, uh, his competition isn't all that great. But it is what it is. I'm looking for Kovalev to get a late stoppage. Um, Chalimba, he can stay out of range, can make it ugly, but I think if he did that, it's gonna be a unanimous decision unless he brings something that we haven't seen before. But Hakeem is picking uh, a knockout around nine to 10. I'm thinking about 10 as well. Um, I think Kovalev is gonna have a little bit harder time getting to him because Chalimba isn't really negated, so Kovalev is gonna have to go out and get him. Um, I would like to see Kovalev make an impressive statement going into the war fight in November. Just like I would love to see War make a statement versus Brand, which he probably will, but it to me doesn't truly prepare him for Kovalev. So give us your thoughts. Click that subscribe button. Let us know your thoughts. Tell us if you want. Give us some. Give us anything you want to say. Ask us any question. You know we all respond. Until next time, guys. Peace.